Kaffee from Greens. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you, Chair. Ms Simpson, I wish you well. I agree that sustainability, energy security and affordability are crucial questions. However, there's no energy security on a planet with out-of-control uh, emissions. Are you prepared to stand over projects that are not Paris compliant? It seems to me that we cannot spend half of this mandate financing dinosaurs. It was St. Augustine who said, make me chaste, but not just yet. It seems that you are following a similar line of wanting to be Paris compliant, but give me more time. So the key question is, can we do without fossil gas? I certainly think we can. And indeed, as you pointed out, the, uh, the European Investment Bank published an ambitious climate action uh, roadmap. So will we be left behind? Will the EIB go further than we are going? I mean, obviously, there is a local context here. The Shannon Liquid uh, National Natural Gas Project in Ireland seems clear, it seems clear that it will be reliant on fracked fossil gas from the United States. How can we stand over such a project? I mean, you said yourself that the gas network must be future-proof, and by future-proof, I mean other gases other than natural gas that have a smaller environmental footprint. So very simply, will the PCI list uh, only include gas projects which are sustainable and in line with the Paris Climate Goals? Thank you.